Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I'm going to share few ways to make chalk paint at home. And using the chalk paint, I'm also going to do a bottle transformation. This is a much requested video from you guys. So let's start. To make chalk paint, I first mixed one part of plaster of Paris with one part of water. I mixed them well and then added three parts of acrylic color to it. I have used a till blue shade acrylic color in this process and got a till blue chalk paint which is quite useful. It can also be used to get patina effect on your crafts. If not plaster of Paris, you can also mix baby powder and acrylic color to get a chalk finished paint. If you are following this method, then you can mix one part of baby powder with two parts of acrylic color. There is an easier and straightforward method to make some chalk finished paint for which I got this wall primer which is quite inexpensive. I got this from a nearby hardware store. I mixed two parts of wall primer with one part of water. And then added an acrylic color to it. I added some black acrylic color to it because I needed some grey chalk paint. You can mix any color of your choice. There is a way to get your own customized chalk paint where you can make a white chalk paint using any of the method that I explained before. And then you can add some food color to it to get your own customized chalk paint. The advantage of making your own customized chalk paint is you don't have to depend on the color shades that the craft stores make. You can make your own color shades depending on what color that you need on your crafts. In this way I made four different chalk paints. My personal favorite one is the Plaster of Paris one because I believe Plaster of Paris gives a perfect chuck finish to the paint. However, you can use any method depending on what material that you have with you or whichever method you find as the easiest one and the most inexpensive one for you. I did a bottle transformation using the chuck paint that I made. I painted an entire bottle using the thill blue shade chalk paint. When the color was all dried, I applied some white glue on it. After a few seconds, when the white glue was not completely dried, I applied some white primer on it. And then used my hair dryer to dry the white primer.
This method made a few little cracks in the white primer. Here is another technique to get some better cracks in the bottle for which I applied the white glue in horizontal direction. And then I applied the wall primer in vertical direction. Then I made some mod pores by mixing one part of white glue with one part of water. Then I pasted a decoupage napkin on the bottle using the mod pose that I made. Once it was all right, I varnished the entire bottle. I also painted an old jar using the pink chalk paint that I made. Finally, I varnished the jar. So in this video, I have shared how to make chalk paint at home, how to get cracked effect without crackle medium, then how to make your own mod pose at home. I hope the video is helpful for you. If you like the video, please press the like button and subscribe to my channel. I'll be back with some more interesting crafts and some crafting techniques. Till then, bye-bye.